So we have arrived in Salta after about 20 hours of another bus ride. Um, yeah, so we're here, we're in our hostel. Um, things have worked out pretty good today. <laughs> Not like yesterday, yesterday was a one-off day, but um, yeah, so we're here in Salta. We have three nights. Um, there's a barbecue tonight at the hostel, so that's gonna be awesome. We're gonna check that out. And then there's a whole bunch of things to do here in Salta. Um, I'll tell you guys about that later, but we're, we just arrived and uh, we're just going to get settled in and uh, yeah, we're going to head out for the day. It's still early. It's only about 10 a.m. So we have the whole day. So we will catch you guys in a bit here in Salta, Argentina. Woo! All right, here we are guys in Salta having some lunch some late lunch because uh, wow. we got in really late and we uh, went and booked some tours so uh, we got two tours through Nor Nordic travel we got one that's going to Capayate and then we have the other one you see there's Salta there that's gonna take us to Huhui which is there and then it's gonna take us up to Kumahuaca which is a whole bunch of cool towns and stuff up there so we got a great deal we got these cool cute empanadas so <clears throat> so it is right in uh, Argentina their empanadas are really small but in Chile they're really big yeah. so yeah just uh, enjoying ourselves here in Salta day one Hola, we're having some lomo I think it's back ribs of the beef and this thing is called the uh, humita it's a snack and uh, made with fresh corn milk also with onion spice and goat cheese so let's see how it is very traditional local dish oh, oh. interesting ah. a store here in Hui Hui Volcan is the name of the city and uh, look at these llamas but um, yeah we're going to on a tour today and uh, we're going to Huma Huaca and then we're gonna check out a whole bunch of other towns but um, yeah today's tour is gonna be really cool and we got another tour tomorrow but um, look at all these cool little things they have here these dogs a day tour here today and then from there we're gonna go up and uh, it's about 12 hour tour and then uh, we're gonna check out a bunch of small towns and the main town is Humahawaka so should be pretty interesting looking forward to it so exciting day here in Salta famous seven color mountain so seven different colors unbelievable to see this you got like orange yellow purple red purple you know whites all over thousands of years here unbelievable guys it's really really cool to see He was saying, the tour guy was saying that's from the algae over time. And then see so you got orange there, yellow, purple. Count the colors, guys. How many do you see? <laughs> Unbelievable. It's 
So here we are in the town of the province of Hui Hui. So this uh, church we're about to see here, uh, from what we were told, is about the, the oldest church in uh, this area. It's from 1600s. So I think he was saying 1648 is how old this church is. That's something else. This is one of the popular towns to check out. So we're gonna try to climb it a little bit and get a better picture. So we found the way up. And uh, what a view from here. Look at that. Wow. The town of Pumamarca is the name of this town. What do you guys think? <laughs> so we don't go spend there, we go spend here. Yeah. How do you look? Nice? <laughs> mm, sing. See. See? Come on sing. guys, what do you think? <laughs> no. So we're in the next town, and the next town that we're in is by the name of Tilkara. So this is one is famous for the cactus up on the top, which we chose not to go in because it was a little bit expensive, and we chose to rather shop as uh, Perth got her new hat, as she's just telling me this is her second favorite hat. So you can see here. My first nice. favorite hat is from Peru. First favorite hat is from Peru, and then I got a sweater which you will see in this picture right now. Um, and uh, yeah, we're just here in Tokara, looking at uh, the color formations on the mountains as well in the background. There's lots of cool little shops here. Look at those mountain formations, colors all over the place here. This is in the northwestern region of Argentina. And uh, this place here, Tokara, is actually famous for archeological sites. So that's what we were told. So yeah, moving on to the next town.
Wow, that's quite amazing. This is what he was just saying there, is this is what they use to cook their uh, pots. So they'll put them inside there and uh, that's how they, they put the water on it and then they take it inside and then put more water on it and take it out here and then they cook them to get that orangey kind of color. And the ones in the black, they use uh, some charcoal to get the black ones. So pretty cool the way they do it. So here we are inside the store. So they make all these clay pots. Pretty cool. So we're in the town of uh, Guanaco and uh, guys, <clears throat> you want to see a big llama? This thing I'm about to show you here is uh, one of the biggest, most monumental things in uh, this area of Huama Oaxaca. So yeah, here, take a look. Look at the size of this thing. Huge. It's a huge llama. <laughs> hey buddy Hey <laughs> Look at them all, there's so many of them yeah. Oh, it's time to eat. Oh, the other one's coming over. Oh my goodness, this is hilarious. here just because, you know, um, 14 Spanish advances were stopped in uh, the Gorge of Malaca. Gorge of Malaca has been a, a key place, maybe the most important place, area for Argentine independence, right? So in that uh, sculpture we're going to have represented all the people that fought for independence in the Gorge of Malaca. So we're climbing up these stairs, so we were told there's 103 stairs to get to the top here and apparently an amazing view And we just realized that we're at 3,000 meters here, so You kind of feel it a little bit and it's extremely hot here um, We were told by our tour guide That we are closer to the Sun here to the equator, so it's really really strong the UAV so my white body. Maybe it'll turn into a brown body. Let's see. <laughs> but this is really cool here, going to the top. Wow, it's 
sure beautiful up front. Wow. So that monument on the top there is the last leader of the Homolokans. That was the independence. This is their independence monument, so that's really cool. The town of Humahuaca. All right guys, so we're done for the day. What a day. We had uh, a lot of things to see, mountains, food, and everything. It was awesome. So uh, long bus day, it was about 12 hours, 13 hours. But we're done for the day. Now we're gonna go cook some uh, dinner because everyone's up late here so time to go get some food we'll see you guys later